name is Akshay Tapare. I am the son of Mr. Dr. Kumar Tapare, who's age 85, and he was successfully treated at Ben Eagles Hospital in Mumbai. He was treated for a condition called uh, NPH, which is normal pressure hydrocephalus. He actually came to Ben Eagles because of a referral to Dr. Hustak by my father, by my brother-in-law and sister-in-law. Hustak she corrected a wrong that was done to my father. My father was misdiagnosed with Parkinson's. He was mistreated by a completely different hospital. Came into Dr. Hustak and then Dr. Dange's hands and they successfully treated him and diagnosed him perfectly. My father was in a completely shambolic state. He was bedridden, couldn't walk, couldn't talk properly. Very, very educated uh, man, very senior architect in the UK and in India great sculptor and he lost the function of his uh, his hands, his bodies, his legs. And within, I think, the space of two weeks, Dr. Dange, uh, Dr. Mayur Gharat, Dr. Bhatia and Dr. Hastak corrected that, that through surgery by the placement of a valve which allowed cerebrospinal fluid to flow out from his brain, which was causing this condition. I can just say, through the bottom of my heart, thank you to Glen Eagles. They've really given my father a second lease on life. I think improved the rest of his life. So I really thank you for your help and your assistance in supporting my father. Thank you. So in continuing with this patient, Mr. Kalpade, who presented and was brought by his son who lives in the US. He had come for a vacation here and his father uh, who is in India, uh, residing in Bombay, but stayed on and off in the US as well as Mumbai. So he suffered from riot of symptoms like imbalance on walking, memory disturbances, as well as the frequency and urgency, as well as sometimes we used to bed with. This patient, Mr. Kerplay, was brought to us and we did a diagnosis by doing an MRI. We suspected normal pressure hydrocephalus and we did a lumbar puncture which is called a neuropathic lumbar puncture which showed improvement after draining 30 to 40 cc of CSF from his back and once it confirmed that it was a normal hydrocephalus so responding to drainage lumbar puncture we offered them procedure called as ventricular peritoneal shunt Programmable ventricular peritoneal shunt was done by doing a surgery, minor surgery from the brain to the abdomen, a pipe was put, which is called as a ventricular peritoneal And you can see how well and very significantly has responded to this procedure. And it is a very rewarding surgery when done appropriately and for the patient selection is the right candidate. Thank you.